Hi guys, welcome to another episode of Just Bet Before the Whistle. I'm Terry Carell, joined by my dashing co-host. The bald wonder, Leighton Levy, and we are here to give you the Just Bet odds, tips and predictions for this weekend's top sporting events. Now we start with track and field. Usain Bolt returns to action in the men's 100 meters this Friday at the Diamond League meeting in London. Race time is 3.29 p.m. Now for the Just Bet odds. Bolt to win, $1.10. Jimmy Vico to win, $7. Mike Rogers to win, $9. While Nesta Carter and Kevin Bailey Cole coming at odds of $15. Now guys, Usain Bolt has struggled to find his form all season due to injury, while his rival Justin Gatlin of the United States seems to be blazing up the track. Still, Bolt has not been beaten since 2012 and is still the big favourite to win this race. Come on guys, you know he's also my favourite. Clearly I'm going to go with the big man Bolt for the win. Now Bolt has been training really well these past few weeks and is coming in expecting to win. Now if he's expecting to win, I have no option but to go with him for that win. Naturally. On to football. Barcelona will take on Manchester United in the International Champions Cup pre-season tournament this Saturday in California, match time 3pm. Now the just bet odds. A Barcelona win brings in $2.00. A Manchester United win brings in $3.10, odds of a draw $3.30. Now Barcelona beat the LA Galaxy in their last match a few days ago, while Manchester United beat the San Jose Earthquakes in their last encounter. Now the Barcelona squad is without Messi, they're without Neymar, but they're still very deep and they're being led by Luis Suarez. It's why I expect them to win this match by a goal to nil. On the flip side, the acquired players for Manchester United have started to play very, very well, but it matters not. I'm going to go with Barcelona for the win, two goals to one. Still on football, the Reggae Boys will take on Mexico in the final of the CONCACAF Gold Cup this Sunday in Philadelphia. Match time is 6.30 p.m. Now the just bet odds have Jamaica to win at odds of $5, Mexico to win at odds of $1.70. Odds of a draw, $3.60. Now remember, the odds are based on the results after 90 minutes and injury time and do not include extra time or penalties. Guys, the Reggae Boys have done the unthinkable. They beat the USA in the semis and here they are in the finals against all rivals. Mexico. The Reggae Boys defense has been absolutely outstanding during this tournament and they're actually managing to convert good scoring opportunities. Now Mexico managed to squeeze past the 10-man Panama side in the semis and they might be a handful for us. But you know what? I really don't care. I'm going to go with the Reggae Boys all the way for the win. Two goals to one. Now Jamaica has beaten Mexico only once in their last 12 meetings but as we've seen in this tournament that means absolutely nothing. The Reggae Boys are confident and which is why I'm picking them to win this match by two goals to one. Albus Powell, how you like them apples? Here are my winning picks. I have both to win at odds of $1.10. I have Barcelona to win two goals to one at odds of $8.50. And I have the Reggae Boys to win two goals to one at whopping odds of $20, bringing my total odds to $187. Meaning, if you put down $1,000, you could win more than $187,000. Now here are my winning picks. I have Usain Bolt to win at odds of $1.10. I have Barcelona to win 1-0 at odds of $10. I have the Reggae Boys to win 2-1 at odds of $20. That brings my total odds to $220. Which means if you spend $1,000 on my picks, you could win $220,000. Now on this week's Take It or Leave It, earlier this week, three Jamaican athletes, Sharika Williams, Kemali Brown and Andrew Fisher, have decided to switch allegiance to represent the Irish nation of Bahrain. That news has been met by harsh criticism in sporting circles. So guys, take it or leave it. Do you have an issue with Jamaican athletes switching allegiances to other countries? I'm leaving it. Look, this is all about the business of sport. Athletes have to earn, they have to pay bills, they have to live. So if somebody's offering you an opportunity to earn some money, why not take it? I'm leaving it. I absolutely agree with you and I'm going to leave it as well for the very same reasons that you mentioned. At the end of the day, it is business. And wherever there are opportunities for them to make more money, to have better opportunities and of course a better livelihood, really, which one of us wouldn't take that opportunity? I wish them all the best. Thank you for watching. We hope you make some money this weekend betting with Just Bet. To see a full list of Just Bet events and betting odds, or to watch a repeat of Just Bet before the whistle, visit JustBetJA.com. You can also visit Just Bet's YouTube channel, as well as Jamaica-Gleaner.com slash videos. Leave us your feedback on Just Bet's Facebook and Twitter page. Enjoy the weekend, enjoy the games, and make, make that, that money! money.